So, Mrs. Baker, performing with Southwest, the Southwest's band, is there any rivalry, any tensions? What's the vibe there on the field? It's really exciting because it's not a rivalry. It's We work together and these kids know each other and grow up together. So when we get to work together, it makes it a lot of fun for the kids to get to meet up with old friends and we put a good show on with all the extra people out on the field. Okay, and just one, one more question. What's your thoughts on today's game? What, what do you expect the outcome to be? Well, I'm eternally hopeful that we will win and I think we have a really good chance of winning tonight. It'd be nice to get that trophy back. All right, thank you. Oh, well, practicing with Southwest and their drill team, is there any vibes or connections you guys feel between you two? Um, I feel that we do have a connection, but not at the same time, because our styles are so different. Um, but I think we all get along. All right, thank you. Um, I think that our football team is going to win again because they've been winning like this whole season. What do you think about the Spirit Week that we've had that is going on? Um, I think the Spirit Week was fun and like I think for the next time more, sh more people should do it. Uh, what is your opinion on our school spirit? Um, I think we have a lot of school spirit. Um, that we could just show it more. <laughs> How do you feel about our band and sport teams and Tall Flex with, um, sharing a performance with Southwest? Um, I think that that's like a really good idea. I feel like um, like the stereotype is that we're like so against each other, but like we should come together for like performances and stuff like that. Thank you. Welcome. What do you guys think is gonna happen at the game? What do you think the score is going to be? I believe it's going to be like 64 to like maybe 14. 14? It's going to be at least 50. 50? Oh, you got a lot of confidence in that team. Yeah. You anything you guys want to say? Like shout out to anyone? Uh, any members, like any of the team? Like good luck or anything? Oh, um, good luck, Nathan. Nathan? All right. Thank you, guys. I'm Ursula Schuyler and I teach world history and AP US history. What are your expectations for our football team today? Uh, I hope they win, but I don't really have expectations <laughs> one way or another. <laughs> what do you think about the Spirit Week that, that just passed? Uh, it, it, I guess it was good. A lot of people are in blue today. I don't know, not that many people dressed up in my classes the other days. Uh, what is your opinion on our school spirit? I think generally Central has very good school spirit. I like to see it. How do you feel about our band, Tall Flags, and Spartan sharing a performance with Southwest? Um, I think that's good. It's uh, We're all one town. We should be able to compete against each other and still be friends. Okay, thank you. <laughs> what are your expectations for our football team? Um, my expectations are for us to go out there and, uh, and win. You know, we got to beat them Eagles. What do you think about the spirit that's going on? Uh, I think it's pretty interesting. Um, Southwest is complaining, saying that we copied theirs, but I don't believe that's true. What is your opinion on our school spirit? I think we have a lot of spirit and yeah. Hello, my name's uh, uh, Mr. Wong. I teach uh, history at uh, Central Union High School, and I graduated from Southwest High School in 2001. What are your expectations for our football team this year? I believe that we're going to defeat Southwest pretty easily. I'm thinking like maybe uh, put up at least 40 points on them, and then uh, you know get some people some playing time, and bring back the uh, city uh, championship trophy. I don't even know what it is, but bring something back uh, that. Uh, you know, deserves to be over here. Today, the city championship. Are you going to the game? Yeah, I'm going. All right, what do you think is going to happen at the game? Central's going to dominate Southwest. That's right. Yes. Any other things that you think will happen? Nah, just that. All right, then. All right for sure. All right, guys. So, are you guys going to the game? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
All right, hey, what do you think Schedule's gonna come out with the dub? Respect that dub, huh? Yeah, from last year. You gonna get that W? Yeah, that that W. <laughs> yeah, that's right. All right, all right, thanks, guys. Hello, my name is Mrs. Pinedo. I teach world history and American government. Okay, what are your expectations for our football team? For the football team, my expectations for this game, um, well, I know they're going to do great. Um, they work extremely hard. Um, the kids, well, the, from what I hear, uh, the coaches say and some teachers, um, I know the students are working hard to be gentlemen, and I really appreciate that. Um, so I'm looking forward to it, and uh, I know they're going to do extremely well. Um, I think it was good. Um, I don't know uh, details, but I think overall, uh, I think kids did the best they could to to wear the colors um, today. There are our school colors today, and I know that a lot of kids participated in the different themes. Um, and I think they did well. Do you think it's hard for teachers to dress out during the school? Sometimes it is. Uh, for me, honestly, for me it was this week. I was extremely busy. Um, I don't, the camouflage one I thought was a good idea, but I didn't have time to go get one. And those are kind of hard to find. And uh, the baby one and, you know, that one about the older person one, um, I don't know. I didn't feel comfortable with that. But uh, I do like spirit weeks, though. What is your opinion on our school spirit? I think... Um, we're, we, we do have a lot of spirit. I like uh, the, the kids, you know, trying to, to, to have more spirit in our school. I think it's important for our unity. And I uh, appreciate the pep club. And, uh, again, the kids that, uh, especially on Fridays, when, when the face painting, I think is great, by the way. How do you feel about our band, Cell Flags, and Smart Teens sharing a performance with Cell Flags? Sharing a performance? It's good because we do have to have um, some type of unity because it is one district. We have to remember that. And it is the same city, right? And uh, we have a lot of uh, people that are related that go to both schools. So I like that idea. I think it's a good idea. Even though I know that our band is better. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank okay, bye-bye. What's your name? My name is Lupe Garcia and I'm a senior. What do you do at practice to prepare for games? Uh, well, we do a lot of drills for hitting and passing, mostly passing because that's the what we mostly need to improve. How do you feel about it being your last year playing volleyball in high school? It's low-key sad, but like I'm excited because I'm like over the school year already. So. Yeah. How do you motivate yourself and others during games to not give up? I try to stay hype and like dance. Try to hype them up, you know, do a little something. I'm just kidding. Oh my god. <laughs> In this segment, we are going to be taking a look at the many clubs at this school today. Today, we will be looking at the first club known as Positivity. Thank you. Positivity meets on Fridays in the libraries. What do you do in Positivity? We help the human society to waste money for the How do you feel when, when you're in Positivity? I feel like what my mom, when she was a little kid, for taking care of those animals to get adopted and other stuff.
So what do you guys think we could do to help reduce the food waste here at Central? Well, we can make sure we finish everything that's on our plate. And if we don't want something, uh, we just leave it inside the cafeteria for somebody else to get. <laughs> well, actually, that's true. That's true. You can leave the food for someone else. When you eat here at Central, do you eat all of your food or do you throw some away? I only eat here at Central, but um, I try not to throw away any food. Maybe. When you get food here at Central, do you eat all of it or do you throw it away? Uh, I, I eat all of it, but at times it's soggy and uh, nasty. I mean, it's not that good, but it's at least it's fulfilling. And how can we, we reduce food waste? Uh, cooking it better, longer. Alright, thank you.